This trip to Ecuador came at the perfect time. I can't believe the impact this journey has had. Lately, I've been in a big rut, struggling to cope with the mundane life back home. The busy city is just too much sometimes. I needed a change. So when we picked up our bikes in Quito, I needed a real adventure. I really didn't know what to expect of Ecuador, but this country has it all. The variation of landscapes within mere kilometers just blew my mind. We went from snow-capped mountains to tropical rainforests to the beach in a day. And where else can you do that? And I think the diversity in the landscape reflects the diversity of the people and cultures as well. It was such an interesting blend of ethnicities. And what they all had in common was this massive pride for their roots. And after the long days of riding, we were always set up in these beautiful accommodations. There was no better way to relax. Travelling with a motorbike, you're closer to the elements. You know, you're taking in the weather and you're as close to nature as you're gonna get. And then you're also close to the people. It still blows my mind the amount of people that wave and smile as you go driving past on the bike. And I think you don't get this intense experience any other way. It's a really welcoming place. And it's made me realize that you know, in all these places where there's a lot of negative press and negative news, in reality, I haven't felt unsafe once. And man, the riding really humbled me. It's been a struggle at times, but we helped each other get out of those situations. And we always made it to our destinations and it gave me such an immense feeling of accomplishment. It was this perfect mix of adventure and then relaxing in the most magical of places. It had such an authenticity to all of it. and it's all led up to this. We're at the ocean, at the end of the journey. So this has really taught me the importance of getting yourself out of your comfort zone. You know, we've seen new cultures, new ways of life, traversed crazy landscapes, and overcome some tough challenges. Along with everything Ecuador has to offer, the most important thing I've learned is that motorcycle travel is not about reaching the destination. It's about the adventure and the moments you embrace along the way. And if you step back and look at the bigger picture, wouldn't that be a great perspective to have on life as well? I haven't felt this inspired in a very long time. And I'm excited to take this feeling and all this new inspiration, take it back home and see what it brings.